Welcome to another day of daily devotions from Manitowoc Cooperative Ministry, where we are the heart of the lake shore. I'm Pastor Matt Sauer, and today we are looking at that part in Acts where Paul and Barnabas are doing some preaching. And they've been preaching. And now we hear there's some confusion among the people that they're preaching to, these Greek-speaking folks. So if you can read in verses 8 through 20, the story, but let me simply summarize this for you. So they've been preaching, and so many people, they, they came and they listened and they heard that they started saying that Paul and Barnabas were the sons of the Greek god Zeus. So they fit this Christian message into their existing pagan worldview. So as you can imagine, when Paul and Barnabas heard this, they were like, oh no, you can't do that. That's You're missing the point here. So it says in verse 15, friends, why are you doing this? We are mortals just like you. I want you to focus on that fact today, that Paul and Barnabas were mortals. Peter was a mortal. All these people we read about doing these miraculous things in the early church, their boldness in teaching, raising of the dead, curing, all of this was done by ordinary mortals just like us. It's easy in our faith journey to look at these giant people of faith and think they must be extra special. And we compare ourselves, and when we do that, most of us find ourselves way, way down on this scale. And we say, well, I'm not like that. I'm not that good. I'm not one of those kinds of things. I'm not a Mother Teresa. But the problem is, folks, that we are the same. We are mortal creations of God, infused by the breath of God, called out, loved, and sent out into the world. All of these great heroes of the faith are mortals, just like us. God calls out to you And just because you don't have the same gifts to do what some other Christian is doing doesn't mean that they're better than you. All of us are called by God, and we are given the tools and the resources and the gifts that are necessary to serve God. So don't be prideful, but... Celebrate that even as a mortal, God loves you each and every day. Let's pray. Calling holy God, thank you for infusing us with your spirit, by leading us forth, by giving us the gifts to be able to do whatever ministry is needed. In your name, come, Lord Jesus, come. And let us not judge ourselves against others, but instead celebrate the Christ that lives within us. Because we do have enough. We are good enough. We are able to be everything that you need us to be. For we are your resurrection people. Amen. Remember, you are worthy, you are loved, and you were created to be a blessing. So go and be a blessing in any way that you can today. Have an awesome day.